Hello everybody, and welcome to the Chemaxon portfolio presentation. I hope that in the time allotted to me today, I can give you a brief overview of our tools, their features, and how they might help you. One of the things we at Chemaxon are known for is the breadth and number of tools that we have. So for the sake of clarity, in some sections I've added a small table to describe where a tool may be in its life cycle. Whether that tool is early in its life and the full set of valuable features is still being explored, uh, an established tool whose features are still growing, or a tool that, for technological or other reasons, is currently focused on sustaining its feature set. We'll start by looking at Chemaxon software used for structure sketching and depiction. Marvin Sketch is Chemaxon's desktop drawing application, and it's proved to be a reliable partner for chemists in drawing molecules, single step reactions, queries, Marcuse structures, and even complex synthesis schemes. Applying styles and colors and graphical elements, you can make clear illustrations that are loaded with chemistry. The built-in calculations are a real added value, giving access to all the popular physico-chemical descriptors from Chemaxon. Marvin.js is our web sketcher and introduces fast and intuitive chemical drawing to any web application. It's gained popularity as the editor component of choice in ELNs, inventory systems, compound catalogs, or many public compound databases. Marvin.js may also serve as the renderer of live structures or static images online. Not so far in the future, we expect that all the lessons we've learned from the development of Marvin Sketch and Marvin.js will eventually be combined in our next generation chemical editor, which we're currently referring to as Marvin NG. BioEdit is Chemaxon's biological editor. While Marvin Sketch and Marvin.js both support peptide drawing, BioEdy is superior to both when it comes to macromolecules with complex inter- and intramolecular connections. Brought to life by the Pistoia Alliance, the monomer-based Helm representation enables the depiction of multi-domain molecules built up even from non-natural residues. Thanks to this native Helm support, BioEdy enables the drawing of engineered peptides, bioconjugates, and other biologics right inside your web browser. And as promised, here is our first overview diagram, which gives a little context of where our sketching tools are within their life cycle. I'd now like to move on to the chemical search engines, which provide the real backbone of many of the Chemaxon tools. These are often known as the JChem family, and JChem Base provides the starting point for anybody looking to integrate chemical handling and database searching in their workflow. Its rich Java API integrates Chemaxon offerings such as calculators, extensive structure representation, and querying across a myriad of database formats. Our first generation Oracle cartridge saw us bring these capabilities to enterprise solutions improving the performance, and this time providing an interface using Oracle's native SQL language. Finally, Web, JCAM Web Services enables our users to use Chemaxon's technology easily in their web-based applications. It exposes a REST API to enable straightforward use as a backend. Our second generation of JCAM engines overhauls these search tools with modern features. All of our second generation tools run on a brand new engine, taking advantage of the database's inbuilt indexing tools to greatly speed up combined queries. They also provide hit as you draw near real time search results, as well as hits sorted in relevance order. Our PostgreSQL cartridge brings chemical searching to this ever more popular RDBMS, while our second generation Oracle cartridge dubbed Coral for chemical oracle language, helps bring your searches to the cloud with full AWS RDS compatibility. This cloud readiness is mirrored in our JCAM microservices, which enable the power of the JCAM engine in a modular distributed fashion. This allows our users to set up their web applications in a highly available fashion. 
One of our more recent offerings for searching is MADFAST. By relying on high volumes of in-memory data storage, MADFAST is able to perform real-time searches in libraries numbering hundreds of millions of compounds. This enables us to perform overlap searches on extensive libraries, comparing one library of millions of compounds to another one of millions more. This provides a clearer vision of your similarity space and overlap between libraries. Although it's nominally a toolkit, MADFAST provides a highly interactive web UI, which also provides you with the capability of changing fingerprint types and similarity metrics on the fly. Taking advantage of asynchronous search calls also enables us to provide hit-as-you-draw capability. The Biomolecule Toolkit is a back-end tool that can be used for manipulation, searching, and storage of modalities that struggle to be represented in classical chemical representation. By natively supporting FASTA and HELM formats, peptides, oligonucleotides, conjugates, and a wealth of other biologics can be easily represented, standardized, stored, and searched upon. The MOL format is also natively supported, which allows for chemical modifications of customer monomer libraries to be easily created and recognized. Through REST and Java APIs, the toolkit can be easily accessed to either extend your current informatics systems or run as a core backend. This allows you to fill in the blanks and in incomplete substance descriptions and marry the chemical and biological systems rather than hopping between separated ones. Again, to provide some additional context, here is what we consider to be the life cycle of our search engines. We'll now talk about our data management and controlled substance detection tools, which we believe are crucial in effectively using um, and keeping track of all your generated data. We start with Instant JChem, which is by now a well-established mainstay of the cheminformatics arena. This desktop application allows users to connect to their corporate databases directly and generate form-based views of their data. Its true power lies in its ability to interact with tables in the database and create complex relationships between entities, therefore harnessing the interrelatedness of your data. To reduce the workload on this desktop tool, it can easily work with our cartridge technologies, speeding up searching and structure handling on large-scale databases. Plexus Connect has brought a web-based front-end to the powerful core of IJC. By using this thin client, we are able to view and interrogate forms generated on an IJC backend quickly and easily and we don't have to concern ourselves about whether our local machine can handle large database connections. A recent facelift of Plexus Connect comes with greater flexibility. Here we introduce the greater ability to modify the layout of the application, as well as the possibility to create forms directly on the client. This brings even greater power to the user to constantly reassess their needs on the fly and keep their interaction with the data meaningful. Nowadays, chemical data files come from a near endless number of sources, public databases, legacy databases, CROs, academic collaborators, the list goes on. With such a diversity of information sources, ensuring uniformity at the point of entry, either to your organization or to the application, becomes extremely important and can easily be achieved using standardizer and structure checker. Not only this, but ensuring Good data in data science and machine learning applications relies heavily on it being clean. They say that 80% of a data scientist's time is spent cleaning data. And well, these tools could play a huge part in that 80%. Both Structure Checker and Standardizer are available as desktop applications or as embedded toolkits. The compound registration workflow is one I'm sure most of you are familiar with. Not only is it important that compounds are assigned their unique ID within your system, but also that the correct handling of versioning and lots of the same compound, which requires absolute accuracy in assignment and maintenance. Compound registration provides exactly such tools, 
and also integrates the aforementioned structure checking and standardization toolkits to provide a single point of truth. REST APIs make it straightforward to integrate compound registration in your workflow, be it with ELNs, inventory systems, or LIMS. And the downstream client provides data forwarding to other databases, such as the ever more popular data warehousing systems. Compliance Checker is a web-based tool that allows you to maintain regulatory compliance by checking structures against the latest prohibited substances. We maintain a knowledge base of controlled substances across the globe at local, national, and international levels. Using the querying capability of the JCAM engines, the compounds of interest are checked and any potential regulatory issues are flagged. Historical checking is also enabled and information about the legislation that prohibits your substance enables the user to further their knowledge of regulatory nature. A graphical interface is provided as well as single searches, batch mode, and scaffold enumerations can be accessed here. Integration APIs make including compliance checker in your workflows a straightforward process. Once regulatory compliance has been ensured, shipping your compounds has another hurdle to overcome, applying the appropriate HTS code. This is not a trivial process, as the HTS rules are often nested to many levels, with special rules regarding where a structure needs to be within its many layers. Those of you who know what HTS stands for in this context, and I'll give you a hint, it's not high throughput screening, will know exactly what I'm talking about and how painful this is to do manually. For this reason, we've created an HTS code generator, which automatically evaluates the rules provided to you with accurate code. While this module is neatly integrated into Compliance Checker, it is also available in an entirely standalone functionality. We'll now move on to speaking a little bit about how our tools can help you handle the chemistry that's present in your unstructured documents. The JCAM for Office suite enriches the popular Microsoft Office desktop applications, such as Excel, Word, PowerPoint, and Outlook, with a vast body of chem informatics functionalities. These include the drawing of live structures, calculation of structural properties, substructure searching, reaction enumeration, and many more. JCAM for Office Lite puts the focus on molecule drawing and editing while significantly improving the user experience when working with software from multiple vendors. It does this by allowing the in-office editing of structures using whatever your preferred desktop editing tool is. We now move on to the extraction of chemistry from documents, where our naming enables the back and forth conversion of over 200,000 chemical synonyms, drug brand names, agrochemical names, and natural products. Besides the IUPAC rules, it also supports the INCI systematic names that are specific to the cosmetic industry. Building on the capabilities of naming, our chemical entity extraction technology identifies structural entities in text and images and creates annotations with exact locations for future reference. It's commonly used in chemical text mining applications, including ChemCurator and ChemLocator, both brought to you by ChemAxon. When trying to find your chemistry, ChemLocator creates a seamless, automated workflow to regularly index chemistry in your unstructured content sources, whether they're located in local drives or in the cloud. Structures are converted from chemical names, live objects, and images using the ChemAxon naming and chemical entity extraction tools. Simultaneously, the body of the ordinary text is also processed, which provides a search experience where chemical structures can be found in the context of free text and biomedical ontology terms. ChemCurator unites the power of our naming and chemical entity extraction technologies with markers visualization in a desktop interface. The result is a simple yet powerful application that helps to manually recreate markers claims from existing patents and proves very useful in freedom to operate analyses. If you want even more, Markush Editor allows you to auto-generate Markush structures from a set of example structures and create strong claims using an interactive user interface. 
This is the perfect tool for anybody working in the patent drafting workflow. Now let's focus a little bit on the tools that we have available for chemical discovery and design. When working with molecular descriptors, the ability to generate descriptors that are relevant and accurate remains a key point in most cheminformatics workflows. Our property calculators make it easy to fill in gaps in your measured data, predict values for newly imagined structures, and to assess if synthesis is worthwhile based on these values. Simil similarly, we offer a variety of fingerprinting technologies which are essential to make sure that your library analysis and querying provide useful results. Both types of descriptors are also garnering great interest with regards to application in AI and machine learning in cheminformatics, where they provide a basis for training your models. As a part of the constant innovation of our products, we have recently increased the ease with which our calculators can be trained, as well as releasing an accuracy reporting tool. The generation of large virtual molecular libraries is also seeing a large uptick in, appl in applicability. The continued prevalence of high throughput virtual screening, advances in reaction and screening automation, and an explosion in interest in DNA encoded libraries have all contributed their part to this rise. Reactor provides a powerful virtual synthesis engine to allow exactly such generation. Definition of transformation and selectivity rules allows the user to set up their virtual synthesis in a desktop setting. The backend engine is not only integrated into a number of our products, but it can also be used independently to run large batches of transformations, allowing you to effectively scale this library synth synthesis. Work is also underway to transform this desktop tool into a web accessible interface. Marvin Live began as a tool where chemists could collaborate, a sort of online meeting space with a presenter sketching potential structures of interest to a group. A set of live plugins were displayed and provided instant feedback, such as live searches of vendor databases, property calculations, and more, including end user models and other custom plugins. This has recently pivoted, and today we're excited to announce our new product and cloud service release from Chemaxon, Design Hub. Design Hub takes the most popular parts of Marvin Live, an iterative ideation environment, live plugins, and easy integration of your in-house models, and places them at the most focused level of a three-stage hypothesis management. The full hierarchy allows for the initial generation of a hypothesis, which encompasses a number of design sets, which in turn contain a number of generated compounds. This allows for the creation of libraries of hypotheses and virtual compounds, which makes your ideation a persistent and easily searchable part of your institutional knowledge. A back-end overhaul allows efficient use of the latest technologies, including cloud features such as AWS Lambda, to minimize your operational costs. For more about this release, join us on June 2nd for our design-focused session. Again, here we provide an overview of where in their life cycle we believe our design tools are. Now I'd like to speak to you briefly about how Chemaxon tools are available to you in the same workflow tools you may already use in your daily work. This is all part of Chemaxon's best of breed approach. We believe you should use the tools that you choose in the setting that you choose and not be locked to a certain vendor. Our integration into common workflow applications is a key part of this approach, which allows you to directly and visually use Chemaxon tools along with the rest of your solutions. Both NIME and Pipeline Pilot are mainstay workflow tools in the pharmaceutical and biotechnology industries, and our integrations reflect exactly that. The majority of the tools you've seen today are available in some form or other through the NIME nodes and Pipeline Pilot components. Everything from our backend tools such as calculators, the JCHEM tools, and cartridges allow you to interact with your data stores. Even components of traditionally desktop applications such as Marvin 
are available to you to execute chemical sketching and output within your workflow. Popular workflows include the standardization and preparation for downstream workflows, virtual library creation, and clustering applications. The ChemAxon NIME nodes are created in conjunction with our partner organization Infocom, and as of this year, ChemAxon is also an official NIME reseller partner, allowing us to advise and cater to our user needs related to NIME server deployment. As I've mentioned earlier in this talk, even the field of chem informatics is slowly but surely embracing cloud deployment and SaaS product models. Enter Synergy, ChemAxon's cloud platform. Synergy is more than just an online delivery of tools. It is our take on an all-in-one solution for a chem informatics platform. Highlighted in this diagram are the functionalities that can be achieved in Synergy. The orange lines present the interplay between components with gray lines presenting synergies that are soon to come. We strongly believe that by avoiding frequent context switching and by bringing everything the chemist needs to one platform, we can greatly increase the efficacy of working with our tools. All the while, the cloud solution deployment relieves pressure from your internal resources. We've even added a few synergy exclusive tools to facilitate a processed assay data uploader, as well as changing our data visualization tool. This has been recently replaced by Tableau, enhanced with ChemAxon tools to provide the chemical intelligence needed to execute visualization effectively. For more information, tune into our talks on June 3rd, which are focused on data capture, retrieval, and analysis. Cloud offerings nowadays are intrinsically linked to easy to use SaaS products. A powerful backend is all well and good, but its utility can be diminished by complex integration work or the associated IT cost. Chemicalize has done away with this by providing many of Chemaxon's most popular tools in a software as a service offering, providing a straightforward website and UI, including self-serve payment. Chemicalize Pro extends this by providing the features as a SaaS API. The website features demo executions, as well as extremely integration, simple integration walkthroughs and HTML snippets. We have also recently branched out into providing tools for education, specifically looking at education tools that help provide chemical intelligence. The key to this is Zosimus, which is an educational platform providing a responsive quiz framework for teaching and learning chemistry. It has brought new organic capabilities to MarvinJS, such as the ability to draw Lewis structures, polyatomic ions, resonance and mesomeric transitions, and single step reaction mechanisms. In the light of the current global situation, we offer free access to students and educators in chemistry until the end of September. I hope I've been successful in providing you an informative overview of all of the tools provided by ChemAxon and look forward to taking your questions. Thank you.